the start, I absolutely didn't know what to expect. It was much better than I had expected. I didn't have low expectations, but it was really good. Um, I think overall, I was really surprised by how deep the conversations were, how we were in a group of strangers, and that's partly because you're a brilliant facilitator, but also the system was really good. And at the end, I felt hopeful that we could use it elsewhere. Um, and I guess interested in what people had said. The stories and wisdom learning experience was a really positive opportunity to share and reflect on other people's experiences and on my own. The interactive element added an interesting dimension for me to question my personal reaction to the stories and reflect on how and why I would modify my behaviours in the future. I felt a little bit nervous at the start because of the tech issues, but I really enjoyed it. It was brilliant. Thank you. I know we mentioned about, you know, face to face, it's marvellous and, you know, it has its um, advantages, but it also has disadvantages. And I find that Zoom uh, meetings with people can can be just as intense and, you know, broad in terms of what people are willing to talk about. And sometimes they may, maybe they feel in a slightly safer place um, to open up to things. So. Um, you know, don't always run with the um, face to face is best because for some things it, it, it is not necessarily true. Um, and especially for bringing people together from distant parts of the world or countries, uh, in, in which case, you know, an online chat is amazing. I think two things surprised me. One was how profound the conversations were relatively quickly. The other was that I had wondered if the questions would be too broad, um, that it wasn't themed enough, but actually it was fine for people to draw in experiences from different bits of their lives. So that surprised me that that worked so well.